That's wild. Like the classic 24 hours. Do I have to do anything? Autopilot. Oh man, there should have been a, like an actual button sequence that we had to hit for this. That's super cool though. Oh! Are you kidding? everybody welcome back today guys to the channel ride 4 has officially dropped on steam i had to take a look at this game for today it came out on october the 8th so yesterday uh by milestone srl now this game looks pretty promising I played all the past rides before love them i'm not the greatest at these games but they're fun it's 56.99 so it's definitely a steep price tag on here so i'm expecting big things once again this year from ride 4 now i did not get the dlc packs that are, i do believe 339 a piece japanese bikes and the European bike packs have dropped uh, but I'm hoping that we have online today hoping that we can do a few things and uh, start our career mode there's supposed to be some nice dynamic weather and the endurance races uh, I've been told are pretty cool on the start so we're gonna definitely take a look at all that for today ride four for our first impressions on the channel is it worth 56.99 man we're gonna find out today thank you guys so much for watching right, and of course before we start today dad joke of the day it's got a little spooky vibe to it this one's coming from reese brown one two three dad joke why did the skeleton not ask his crush out because he didn't have the guts man okay big thanks for watching leave your halloween dad jokes and or two wheel dad jokes down below and of course don't forget to slap that like button we're just gonna go start up challenge. I need a 103 on Scuba. Let's have a quick look at this game here. I do believe they've put me on some heavy, uh, some heavy assists on right now, looks like. Yeah. That's a nice bike. Now I'm curious if we'll let me do a peel. Oh yeah, bro. Okay. Oh, little biker boys out here. Good, we need a 103. Now I do believe it's on automatic. Yeah. Do you lose? Oh, yeah, I yeah. Oh, it's heavily assisting here. Right, we're going to try this one more time here. I got this. I got this. Look at our brake. Look at our brake fluid. Is that brake fluid? I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, that's cool. You can see his fingers moving. Trying to stay on track here. Oh, boy. I have all of the road. These guys are insane with how well they control these bikes. They need to be near perfect. There's no, like, there's barely any correction that, that you can really do with these. I'm trying to just keep my throttle not on 100%. If stuff like this happens. The more throttle you do, though, right, the less you have to correct. No, I touched the grass. God. You gotta just commit to the corner and just not give it gas until you're ready. And then, yeah, look at oh my. Try not to uh, use the brakes. I'm gonna try to maybe use the back brake a little bit more. I don't know why I haven't. Maybe that's why. Okay, that's why right there. Oh. And thankfully, traction is on because I think half of these accelerations that I do right now would probably be me flying off the bike. Oh my! All right, here we go. Not do that again. This game is mean sometimes. All right, we're looking good. We're looking good. Oh, nobody's behind, right? First place. So I bring it home. I'm gonna hide myself out for the last race. Of the intro challenge target time attack. Right here we go, man. Did I? 103.2. Oh, wow. Can't believe we missed that. Ooh, yeah. This game definitely uh, looks beautiful as always. Ryan always comes. Look at how shaky I look. Oh, my God. I mean, this is what would happen if Forza made a motorcycle game, in my opinion, right? This is what I would expect Forza to feel and look like. So, I mean, this is this is pretty impressive stuff out here, what these guys have done um, to just kind of bring that simulation feel to two wheels. Right, four. If you haven't already taken a look at it, definitely check this out, especially if you're a fan of motorcycles, anything racing, competitive. Nice Yamaha bike. That's oh, the same bike I was just racing with. Yamaha's YZF R6 2015. That's a nice bike, man. 
debut regional league, European league. Once you've chosen your starting regional league, you won't be able to join the other leagues until you've obtained access to the world league here. Okay, so um, let's go to let's go to the American League. I feel like I'm gonna know a few more tracks there. American League, okay. There's no Canadian League, right? What the hell is that? What am I saying here? We have a new physics model able to recreate the behavior of bike and rider with an increasing number of details. Moreover, with tire consumption now active, your riding style will affect your tires. An aggressive approach will lead to greater tire consumption. Also too, we have the endurance races. We have customization as well too. And uh, let's go ahead into the main menu quick. And let me just see what we have. We have downloadable content, bike and rider. Dealership, personal garage. Ooh, Harley Davidson? That's pretty cool. Oh, look at this thing. Wow. I want to be able to start these up or something. Can I? Oh, we can have them in different colors. All right, let's back out of there. What else we got here? Kawasaki, Suzuki. Oh, right. These are clean. The graphic models on this game are pretty impressive. 2.6 million dollar bike. 2.6 mil for this thing. We got a lot of bikes. Personal garage we do have, which is pretty cool. I like this dealership aspect though. Engine, we can change engines as well too if we want. Exhaust. Oh, look at all the different tips. How sick is that? No, I don't want that on for five grand. I'm just looking. I can't look at them. Oh, there we go. Okay, just takes a little bit of time to load in. Yeah, this is definitely the Forza bikes, man. This is this is pretty cool. A lot of different helmets. Oh man, they are stepping up their game. I don't remember this much customization in uh, Ride 3. I like this helmet a lot. I like that kind of back fin visor on there. We're gonna grab that. Visors? Oh, we can go with different visors. Gold. Is there a green one? Because that'd be kind of cool. Go with the track replica Evo. Pretty fire suit. They're also 4,500, man. Damn. Okay, let's have a quick look at our track list. Hands Hatch, North Schleife, Northwest 200. I don't know what that is, but that looks pretty damn cool, though. Uh, Olten. We have Imola, French Riviera, Donington Park, Codwell Park. Oh my God, look at them all. Southern 100. It's just in Europe. We have America, Canadian Tire Motorsports Park, Laguna Seca, Virginia, Road America, Utah, Interlagos, and Road Atlanta. On the Asia side, we have Kanto, uh, Okayama, Suzuka, Phillip Island, Sugo, and Scuba. Solid lineup of tracks on the game here we need to ride though man we got to look at the endurance man everyone's talking about the endurance here we gotta have a look at this can i loan yes you can loan something thank you we're gonna go with the green one looking good track what, can i do road america endurance right we're going to track here ride four hope you guys are having a great week um tomorrow's episode top 10 drifts is officially coming back i haven't i haven't really said anything anywhere but Top 10 Drifts is coming back tomorrow. Waiting to see how many people are playing online though, right? That is gonna be the thing. Now, weather and lighting, starting conditions, change of rain, let's go. Chance of rain, we're good. Okay, this is gonna be the on foot start for the endurance race. Oh man, look at everybody. That's super cool. That's wild, like the classic 24 hours. Do I have to do anything? Autopilot. Oh man, there should have been a, like an actual button sequence that we had to hit for this. That's super cool though. Oh! Are you kidding? I'm still an autopilot, man. No way. I can't believe that just happened. That's amazing. I couldn't even do anything about that either. That's the, that's the worst part about that. I can't even change cameras in here. Nothing. Are these guys okay now? Yeah, they're good finally. Unreal. Has that ever happened to you guys on this game or not? Would love to know. Yeah, we have, anybody, yeah, we have two riders behind us. We'll bump him out the way, sorry. A few more bumps. I feel like I'm playing just a damn next gen version of Road Rash. Start kicking people off the bikes and shit, right? That would be pretty cool. It would be cool to see a proper simulation style bike open world game. I don't think there's ever been a thing before other than the crew too, right? But I'm saying proper physics like these on an open world game would be pretty neat. Oh boy, let's just go for the endo. I Helmet looks sick. Oh boy, let's just go for the endo. Yeah, we gotta get the photo vote on that one there. Look at this. Process image. 
action shot might take a while to process. How long are we talking here? That was pretty cool though, nonetheless. I should have processed it, but... Okay, I just wanted to take a look at the endurance start on that. That was, that was pretty cool. We have just nice flow of menu music here too. I like this. Lobby list. Who do we got online today? 11 out of 12. Network status. Pretty weak duration. One out of three laps here. So we got a chance here to hop in. Oh my. They're on the Norch life of three laps and I hit join. That's, yeah. Super smart. I like it. Okay, there's something I wanted to take a look at. Single race. We're going to leave the career mode for another episode. If you guys do want to see that, make sure you guys go ahead and slap that like button down below. We're going to go to tracks, and I do believe, where was it here? Yeah, the Southern 100 and the two, uh, Northwest 200. So let's go to this one first. All right, I'm riding the antique here. RC181. $2.2 million bike, I think. Is that is that how much it is? Now, is everyone riding this bike? No. Nope. Kind of. Some of them are. Oh, wow. Yes, man. Look at this thing. Wow, it's old. Can we end no? Oh yeah, we can. We're definitely gonna have to take off full settings here in a second. Do I have enough brake? Uh, oh, excuse me. Jet plane. Try to sandwich one of these guys here. This guy's getting rowdy. Ooh, this is a nice little. Uh, come on, come on. Look at me! Oh! For some reason, my bike's faster than everyone else's. And I'm on 70 difficulty. Oh, we caught a curb! That was kind of cool. Wanna do that again? What are these? Oh, big old damn corner coming up here, looks like. Yeah. No lift! Why is it yellow? It's ripping by everybody. Two forty-four. I want to hit a big jump or something. That'd be kind of cool. Geez, we are flying two fifty kilometers an hour right now, and we're gonna be coming up to a nice corner here. Take it back first place very soon. Elvin Finch. I wonder what happens if I just let it. Right, I'm not even gonna let it off here. I'm gonna tap this guy's rear bumper. Oh my goodness. 250, we crashed. Oh, sorry. Oh, he reset in time. Oh, yeah, yo, the photo mode even works after you've crashed. My bike. Oh, damn, we both collided into that. Let's go to actually. We're gonna pick up the FS450 and we're gonna change into our moto gear. And here we go. We're going to make it on hardest difficulty, I guess. We're going to go 99. Very hard. Kanto Temples. Nice secluded area. We're going to bring in some nice, noisy, uh, nah, 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 right? A little bit of motorbikes. Look how small the tires are. I wonder if there's a dedicated motocross circuit out here with the dirt and everything with the jumps. Look at these. <laughs> Look at these guys, man. Were these in? The last ride? I can't I can't remember who they were in ride three or not, but they were pretty cool though. Look at this. Well yeah, we're on uh, hard difficulty too, or the hundred percent difficulty. Everyone's sticking together pretty good. Extend that out a bit. I'm on a dirt bike, I should try that little shortcut that was there. Go, go, go. Look at the fluid just bouncing though, I love that about this. What? Now the fact that we have traction off, we can actually throw this thing a bit. Oh no, man. Trying to drift it. Trying to slide it, I guess, is the right turn. Yo, okay, we got that, we got that. Not too sure how I'm still going, but I'll take it. Ooh, diving into the corner? Cross 
Proper wheelies too. This is impressive. Oh my! And then I had thinking this Kawasaki Ninja looks menacing, man. Look at this thing. Here we go. Ride four. Now we didn't do anything with the career mode, um, but for first impressions, right? I mean, this is a great two wheel experience as it always is with these ride games, right? So definitely, if you're interested in these, as always, you're going to be definitely impressed with it. A couple new things this year. We got right. We got the endurance races. We got the weather system coming in. They've definitely made some great changes, and that's just the surface. I don't really know too much about the details and, you know, what's good or what's bad at the game. So if you guys have your own two cents to add in, leave it down in the comment section down below. Definitely appreciate everyone's feedback. And uh, nice to see, you know, what people that actually play the game think about the game. Because obviously this is just, you know, my two cents. I don't play a lot of, you know, two-wheel games, so it's hard to tell. But from, all, from what I've played so far, yeah, this is... It's fun. It's hard, but it's fun, though. We... I... Forgot that I had everything turned off, so yeah. Here we go. Look at the big muffler on the side. Oh shit. Did I just hear turbos? I. Everyone's got a turbo. Wow, that's cool. Yeah, so just very little throttle until you get right out of the corner. Ooh, wow, this is fast. It's so fast. Oh, <laughs> just kidding. We did change bikes, looks like. And we got a couple different bikes out on here. Come on. Oh, big wreck back there. I did not... I actually did not cause that one for the first time. I did not cause that wreck. Pretty happy about that one. God, these guys are insane, man. Passing at no... No care on those passes. That was a nice pass, though, I will say. Jeez. Aggressive. I mean, that's kind of how I need to be. And then, oh, wow. All right, we got the corkscrew coming up, and I'm really debating. Should I just send it over the corkscrew? It's been fun today on Ride 4, man. Thank you guys so much for watching today. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.